Excalibur episode 12, and I'm oddly reminded of a Hollywood Undead music video. Oddly titled to something about watching cities burn. Don't really remember how it goes. It's not like I Googled it before the you start, just so I didn't accidentally call the wrong band. No, 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 no. The fire crackling sounds more like fire crackling and more like I'm burning my pop. for me several hours later. So, someone want to tell me what the fuck just happened? What? What was that? Oh my god, that was huge! Oh my, what was that? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Is village still on fire? I know I grammar bad. Watch out. Apollo! I should have known. You and the rest of the Phantoms, you were behind this, weren't you? I didn't need an explanation on what that huge explosion was. What was that and who caused Actually, it? Everything I know you fire. have an answer for me. What happened? Gasoline. Boom. Listen to me, Prez. I know this looks bad, but trust me. I tried to stole him off the best I possibly could. Did a very good job. But unfortunately, Maverick finally caught on to me. He knew that I knew where that temple was, and he had to force me to bring the rest of the phantoms there. And they broke off the ten you seals. The first layer of the Excalibur okay, temple's been open. That that's what the huge explosion Strange, was. Isn't it? So all he needs to do now for the second layer is to obtain the three wicked god cards. <laughs> He's already on that start. Do you know what this means, Apollo? From that one installment, just from that one explosion from that tower, we might not get another chance at defeating Maverick. This could be it already. All he needs is those other wicked god cards and we're finished. I'm sorry, Prez. I did the best I could to prevent him. You didn't him. do a very good job. I also got some additional information for that you. That is a good job. Maverick finally... <sighs> he confessed on what he's gonna use for his Excalibur powers. He says that he's keeping us imprisoned by the Shadow Games. If we ever fail that, he's going to send us back. But he needs us for that temple because if he gets his hands on Excalibur, he's going to recreate the world with that same Shadow Game engine. Wasn't the world already with the Shadow Game engine? So wait, world recreation, and he's using that same material in the Shadow Realm. Then that means, yes, the end of the world. It's the but it doesn't have to be that way. I have an idea. He can only get our support because of that one string force spell that was put upon us. On, and there's a crystal at the center of our hideout where he has that. And, say, and if we can somehow get to it and destroy it, bad. then he won't keep us prisoner that any longer and I can free the rest of the phantoms. Unless the ones that are willingly under his powers. I can help you there. And if you can successfully destroy it, then we can start on our path to defeating Maverick. 
Okay, I think that's a good idea, Apollo. We gotta destroy whatever that crystal is. And if we can get rid of the rest of the Phantoms, Maverick shouldn't be that tough to defeat as long as we got the right support. These heroes are way Let's too get it. quick to destroy beings of infinite power. Why would you think that you can destroy it? There was something alive there? Maybe a cat? I don't know, whenever Fred walked past, it looked almost alive. Probably one of his cats fucking around. Or a tree, who knows? I like this track. It's probably gonna get copyrighted, probably by Nintendo, but still. Yeah, if you get an ad in this video, odds are it's due to copyright claim from Nintendo. Oh, here's something that trade doesn't make sense to me. There it is. Okay, so Fred owns a rifle. Why the fuck in two episodes did he need a Wiimote to destroy- to kill him? Was this- I assume this is from his father, so maybe his father bought it after the Wiimote that was introduced, but just realistically just like, you Game have over a sniper. Bag. You have a sniper rifle. Why are you bothering with a Wiimote? Then again, concealing would be harder. I summon my gun in attack mode. Boom, I win. After destroying the Shadow Crystal to bind the Phantoms, Fred sets off on his own. Just as he calms down, a familiar face arrives to his aid. You know, in hindsight, it would have been interesting if we put a duelist in front of that, okay. just so we could have had like Since that Shadow Barrier know, was just taken out, I think Apollo should be it, coming in for the episode? report any second yeah. now. Can't resolve a little too quickly, you know? I wonder how Paxton's doing right now. Huh. I'll tell you what I'm doing. Wasting your time. I finally found you, Prez. I saw you destroy that shadow barrier. I challenge you to no a duel. No matter can't keep us from those shadow games any longer. I'm free. I'm quitting the Phantoms. I'm coming with you now. Zippity doo dah. Zack, you got yourself out of the shadow realm. Not You're one really. One of the Phantoms now. Listen, Zack. For what it's worth, I'm really sorry about what happened that day. When Maverick took you away from the Shadow Realms, and before that, but you gotta understand. No offense, but I've already beaten you three times, and Maverick beat you that once. I don't really think there's. What are you really talking much about? I've been really a better fight against Maverick point. than you did. You tied. So it would really be like best for you if you would just leave right now. It's not safe for you. You see, that's where you're wrong, Prez. See, ever since I was able to join the Phantom, of course, by force now. I got a super eight ultra mega powered combo thing full of cards. And I got a brand new deck in my arsenal. So there's no way anybody can ever beat me. Not even you now, please. As for that temple thing or whatever that was, I know where that is too since I just passed through there. So yeah, I can definitely help you. So what do you say? Come on, let's team up. Well, if you're really sure about your decision, okay then. Just promise me that I won't have to look after you every five minutes, because I don't have time You're, to do okay, that. Okay, Prez, it'll be every five minutes, one yes, second. Yes, awesome! I get to be teamed up with freaking Prez Kamori! It's friendship, friendship, just a perfect friendship. When Maverick and Pedro lose to us, they'll get hit by a bus. La 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 la, yeah, yeah, great. Even though we have tour bus but from the underworld, we're gonna have a temporary yes, team will. up, I need you to cut the singing crap. Because I don't want that. Anyways, during that temple meeting when you broke off the first ten seals, there was a huge earthquake. When Maverick first started the initiation, did he ever tell you about the Wicked God cards or the links connected to them? Actually, no he didn't. Just before we broke off those ten seals, we all, all raised our hands to the air. And Maverick and Pedro were doing just fine, but the rest of How us that Maverick? weren't actually infused with what? the Shadow Games, we just kind of blacked out. And that's really all I remember. Everybody except Ma Maverick and Pedro, they all just kind of blacked out. They just passed out. Well, that's weird. The same thing. Maverick and Pedro are actually the only two members of the Phantoms that I know of that aren't actually attached to that shadow barrier that you were talking about. And you're saying that everybody else passed out. I don't know if they still have that. Maybe this gives game. us a clue on what the shadow so, barrier so thing really is that I just described I never what lose this temple breaking games. thing is all about. But as long as he doesn't get his hands on the wicked three, god cards, we can easily anyway. take him out. Alright, whatever. But listen, Prez, if 
if you want to get to that temple, you remember the realm of grace, right? It was just that place that you said you got the wicked avatar and that huge beam of light. Jack, you couldn't you don't have to be unconscious to get there. There's a special place just around the corner that just gets you there automatically. Jack, you look like a guy where if he punches you in the face, he gets hurt. I'll lead you to there, okay? Let's go. eventually walked over to a huge open field to enter the realm of grace. I know I'm reading all these things, but well, since my face is taking up the bottom of the corner, you might be able this to read it. Place. It's helping. Now, the realm of grace I'm that you experienced before is a little different from the one you're going to be entering. It's like a never-ending forest with bright lights and all never that free stuff. Forest. But if you really want to go inside there and find out what's going on there, then you'll have to follow these instructions. All you have to do to enter Gives is step on the very same place that you're on right now. It's and also hold up your favorite card up to you. Spanish that way the French. portal will recognize you, and it'll automatically transport you to the never-ending forest. And somewhere inside of there is the actual temple where we're placing our three wicked god cards. So why don't you try it out? Okay, Zach, if what you're saying is true, if I just hold up my favorite card on this exact same spot, then I'll be there. This the better not be a joke, Zach. Out. Remember, right now, be well, I guess the favorite card in my deck would have to be the Kamori like, Dragon. Why did I tell so let's see if so what you have to say is true. When their way of getting out is so damn simple. Shoot it with a rifle. Congratulations, you have now accessed the negative filter. Whoa. And now you have reached the higher tone oh, of negative God. filter. I don't remember to mention it. Oh, oh my, my God. You have a purple filter. Except not really considering there are still colors. We get it. Whoa, Zach was right. This place is huge. But if I'm gonna find that temple, it's not gonna be easy. Chris looks like he's going There's to like, gotta be time something that'll lead me there. It can't be just woods going on forever. It must have been some way the Phantoms could have known where the temple was. If there is a way, I'll find it. Zack never told me that there was a time limit in that place. Air, if I would have known air, that, I would have already probably found that place and made my time, time more efficient. Gold dang and I finally I said gold dang it by accident. It makes you! Mask. You're one of the phantoms! I see it in that cloak of yours. I need answers from you. Where's my family? Good! Where's Maverick? Alive. Huh, Prince Kamori. I thought I'd find you here. But enough about me. You might as well be running away right now, because in this shadow duel, I'm gonna be the one to take you out. So I'd start worrying about yourself more than the rest of your I fellow comrades and whoever they are. <laughs> we because need to get an I just challenge you. To be claimed. And under Maverick's control, you're the next one to go down. I'm not playing any games. Whoever you are, I'm taking down every single one of you phantoms. And I'd be more than happy to start with you. So start talking. Prez, you're still just a child, even now. We just restarted the video. You shouldn't be that hard. Even with some of the conditions that you've already put yourself onto, you're still weak. Oh, and by the way, I got a question for you. What two plus two? Where's your brother? I just asked you that. <laughs> Where's your brother, Prez Kamori? <laughs> I just asked you that. Shut up. Just shut up. <laughs> that 
Let's go. Fresh can now fight the shadow by facing this mad jester. Okay. As the curtains pull back, a new twist ensures. I think he meant to say ensues. Dude. Oh my god. Whatever that earthquake was earlier, it's gone now. If this thing is about the wicked god cards I've been hearing about, I then can't there's gotta be something done about slightest. it. I know Fresh meant to be building upon something new. The fact that it goes nowhere Anything. means that this is a waste Anything, of time. Please. I just need to find something about the wicked god. Cards. You have to come back anywhere in the Excalibur dimension now I think about it. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Nothing in this whole history of Yu Gi Oh! book, and I can't find anything about the Wicked God. Well, maybe it wouldn't help if you were... It's so stupid! It, maybe if you weren't reading the Hyrule Historia, that would be a good start. I wish there was a Yu-Gi-Oh! history book. I'd buy that shit. Holy freaking yes. crap! This is a powerhouse card. Too bad this one not fit in my deck. Maybe Minako Kaiba will know something about it. I'll need to contact her immediately. I have some rather urgent This is why we don't have child actors. They suck. Used by my understanding by computer radar just after getting past I the they suck and then in my actors Then, unfortunately, exactly one of our duels so. to the Phantoms by the name of Heartless has taken Press Camorion in a duel. And this is beyond my permission, and if you do this beyond my guidelines, then there will be some rather harsh consequences. Yeah, and the there is also up. another change in plans. We might need to evacuate from this very hideout. Because there's a duel going around by the name of Tristan Powers. And he's starting to get into the rest of our business by finding information on the Wicked God cards. He read and the it just so happens that we have to duel against him. I want you to destroy him effective immediately. Well, that sucks. There's no way that Heartless can take Prez on a duel. He's way too weak. Wait a minute, the I'm the only one who's stupid you. enough to take him Where's down. The entire history of and as for this thing with Tristan and wherever the crap he is, if you're so you tough and big, big and strong, man, why don't you take him a game on game yourself? Of you. It's always I challenge you to a game of Duel Relax, monsters. Pedro. Why should I have to be the one to come up to Prez and just all of a sudden challenge him to a shadow game? That wouldn't make much sense. We don't have time for that nonsense. Besides, it won't really matter because Press Kamori will eventually come to us. You need to learn to be more patient, Pedro, because it's really all going to be a breeze soon enough. Now, as for the other matter with Tristan Powers, I think it shouldn't be that hard to take out a rat like him. We've had to encounter stuff like that in the past before. And I think our phantoms are already strong enough to take out a duelist like him anyway. After all, Press stole his jeep. Master Maverick. With all due respect, I'd like to get a permission to duel against Prisk Kamori myself. Denied, don't be a stupid he accent. He took some of my favorite cards, man, and I can't have that no more. He took I my guy like a cowboy. Sorry, Kibian, but unfortunately you don't fit the job very well. I was the closest one so far to have ever beaten Prisk Kamori in the Excalibur hunt so far. So I think it should be fitting that I should be the one to have to go after him. Because with my new and improved deck, he barely beat me before, and this time it should obtain certain victory for me. And that'll save us a lot more trouble until then. You guys don't listen very well, do you? I already discussed and said just now that Press Kamori will come to us. And it's likely that he'll probably try and take down the weaker members of the Phantoms. Maverick has like that little roll with his other the other bill, Phantoms and that were coming forcefully willed for into come our here, group Prez, and brought like. to join his side. Or better still, that's not ooh, a piece of candy. Ooh, as long a piece as we of candy. have myself ooh, and Pedro in the case, he shouldn't be able to prevail at all. And soon enough, as by the time we get the third Wicked God card from Pax in the Barge, He'll already be outmatched because he can't take out two wicked god cards. Not with even that by some chance he managed to get his out. It's really only a matter of time. Maverick, I have one question now. Apparently, How do they put the M's on the M&M's? And he somehow got into the realm of grace by force again and he tried to search for that temple until he timed out of it. How do you suppose he'll come to us? What makes you so sure that Prince Kamori is going to eventually come to us? His eyes went big for a minute there. Simon, we'll find our way eventually. Uh, it's really actually simple. It doesn't matter which one of us snuck information to him, but we'll probably have to consider that person later on. 
but we'll just give little hints and clues to our whereabouts to him. And if he's smart enough, he'll figure it out by himself. He's not smart Besides, enough. Besides, even if there's potholes along the way, we'll just take care of them. I'd like to imagine I've he said potholes. I know he didn't, but I'd like to decks. imagine that. Oh wait, except for you, I still don't know your name. Hand me your dueling deck. You mean this dueling deck right here? No, the one you I have in your you. other pair of pants that you don't wear. This dueling deck means a lot to me. For some reason, two of its cards are missing. Excellent, I knew you'd see things my way. Now let's take a look at these cards. Oh. Oh. Well, excellent. You've actually surprised me today. Card these cards are amazing. The same monster. Well, a 40 not card as deck of Karibos. But I remember you. Not now. even different versions of Karibos. You were the closest just one to ever me. But of course, you still failed. I don't think I really need to change around this deck. <laughs> but before you go around thinking you're superior to the rest of us, just remember that you don't have any special privileges, no matter how powerful your dueling deck is. So what's this base is a good deck. This change is well needed to We'll call him Mr. Mystery. And with no, the we like that, I think Press Kamori will be able to follow his very first duel anyways. Of course, Heartless is still no match for him. But after this, it'll be a new step towards the end of the world. We'll be able to play with our own weekend nice guy. And just as I promised you, infinite power. Unlimited <laughs> power! Itty bitty living space. Now the shadows come to a ceasefire, that's the track bars, the individual, the light starts to fade. The gears that turn the world into a whole new direction. Those same gears turn to the beginning of the end. Are they ancient gears? And there's no bloopers. Hmm. Interesting. Alright. I guess I'll catch you off there, guys. Bye.